All right, welcome everybody to the stream. At the beginning of the stream, I'd like to go ahead and give a little bit of an introduction to them. They like to learn how to talk at the beginning of the stream. This is a Catholic gaming stream. That means there'll be prayer discussions about theology, saints, or... There we go. Hmm. Various Catholic readings and discussions about going on in the church. There'll also be discussions about the games played to fit theologically wise or with church teachers as we play them. This is a stream for everyone, but you have to be respectful of everyone here. If you have a question about the church, please feel free to ask. I'm only a lay person, however, so many need to find through by asking my priest. If you're doing research on Catholic Answers Live, as such may take time. If you have a prayer request, please feel free to post it. If you can find the stream and channels run by Catholics, then you are in luck. As soon as I remember where my stuff is. Oh, I forgot to post to Discord that I was live. I'll do that in a second. There is Interceptors My Dog Productions, The Punchening, Fortitude, Beard Blevins, Matt 317, Mr. Bushido, Argelian Papa, Father Samuel Beardsley, Catholic Answers Live, This Catholic, Blue Soda, True Great Catholic, K Martinator, Savage Night 99, That Catholic Gamer Dude, Yogurt Archangel, and The Joyful Mind. Thank you very much. God bless. Remember that God loves each and every one of you. Go and sin no more. Now, before we do go ahead and get fully into Terraria, let's do the readings for today and we'll get started. I don't think they are today. It's like I was paying attention during mass, but I went at eleven, and now that's almost twelve hours later. So, I I I, I was doing a pretty good job of paying attention, but that just because I pay attention doesn't mean my memory is good. It's hard sometimes. Yeah, I was gonna say they can't even hear you at the moment just because I've uh, forgot to unmute desktop audio. There we go. Now I didn't. Anyways, the, uh, mainly just because I didn't want the Terraria audio coming. Anyways, I can explain that in a second. These are the readings for May 8th, 2022. Fourth, uh, I need to do one other thing so that way Phil doesn't think I was trying to abandon him. Uh... Okay, now we're good. Okay, these are the readings for the fourth Sunday of Easter. The first reading for today is from Acts chapter 13, verse 14, as well as 43 through 52. Paul and Barnabas continued on from Perga and reached Antioch and Pisidia. On the Sabbath, they entered the synagogue and took their seats. Many Jews and worshippers who were converts to Judaism followed Paul and Barnabas, who spoke to them, and urged them to remain faithful to the grace of God. On the following Sabbath, almost the whole city gathered to hear the words, the word of the Lord. When the Jews saw the crowds, they were filled with jealousy, and with violent abuse contradicted what Paul said. 
Both Paul and Barnabas spoke out boldly and said it was necessary that the word of God be spoken to you first, but since you reject it and condemn yourselves as unworthy of eternal life, we now turn to the Gentiles. For so the Lord has commanded us. I have made you a light to the Gentiles, that you may be an instrument of salvation to the ends of the earth. The Gentiles were delighted when they heard this and glorified the word of the Lord. All who were destined for eternal life came to believe, and the word of the Lord continued to spread through the whole region. The Jews, however, incited the women of prominence who were worshippers and the leading men of the city, stirred up a persecution against Paul and Barnabas and expelled them from their territory. So they shook the dust from their feet in protest against them and went to Iconium. The disciples were filled with joy in the Holy Spirit. And the psalm for today is from Psalm 100. We are his people, the, flock, the sheep of his flock. Sing joyfully to the Lord, all you lambs. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before him with joyful song. We are his people, the sheep of his flock. Know that the Lord is God. He made us. His we are, his people, the flock he tends. We are his people, the sheep of his flock. The Lord is good. His kindness endures forever. And his faithfulness to all generations. We are his people, the sheep of his flock. The second reading for today is from Revelation chapter 7, verse 9, as well as 14b through 17. I, John, had a vision of a great multitude, which no one could count. From every nation, race, people, and tongue, they stood before the throne and before the Lamb, wearing right robes and holding palm branches in their hands. And one of the elders said to me, These are the ones who have survived the time of great distress. They have washed their robes and made them white in the blood of the Lamb. For this reason, they stand before God's throne and worship him day and night in his temple. The one who sits on the throne will shelter them. They will not hunger or thirst any more, nor will the sun or any heat strike them. For the Lamb who is the center of the throne will shepherd them and lead them to springs of life good water, and God will wipe away every tear from their eyes. Alleluia, alleluia. I am the good shepherd, says the Lord. I know my sheep, and my know me. Alleluia, alleluia. The gospel for today is from John chapter 10, verse 27 through 30. Jesus said, My sheep hear my voice. I know them, and they follow me. I give them eternal life, and they shall never perish. No one can take them out of my hand. My Father, who has given them to me, is greater than all. And no one can take them out of the Father's hand. The Father and I are one. The gospel of the Lord. Praise be to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Amen. All right, and with that, we can go ahead and get started. How are you doing today, Cake Ross? I'm doing... It's been an interesting day. Good day, though? I mean, it's I... Mother's Day, so can't... I'm hoping it can't have been too bad. Well, I helped my dad make lunch for my mom. Okay. And... But I didn't actually eat... I, I just have been terrible at... I, there are a couple of health things that I mentioned in the... Uh, um in the discord yeah that um that her plaguing you yeah, yeah basically i can understand that i'm still sorry to hear that though that's not ever fun no it's really not I don't know if you knew this, by the way, but they introduced banners for every 50th enemy you kill. And if you hang them uh, within a certain area, you'll get an attack and defense bonus against them. Oh, nice. So it's not, like, super useful because it's only within a certain range, but it's not awful. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that's not bad. I'm about to get some armor, I think. What, what armor? I don't know. We'll find out. Pro maybe not. Maybe, maybe I won't get armor. So, so what armor it's really bothering me that I can't mouse wheel anywhere in these menus. Can't you? Yeah, you can. I, maybe. Oh, oh, you can, but it goes in the opposite direction of what I'm expecting. Uh, yeah, okay. yeah. Now that you say that, it's like, yeah. Didn't even think about that until you mentioned it. Are you going? Are you going down to the to the to the mining area? Yeah. Oh, I hey. Am. So if you press M on the map, you should be able to see me. Yeah. Now, do I need an anvil to make armor that isn't wood? Is that right? You might. There is an anvil up oh, there. There is an anvil. Yeah, was say, oh. There. You do need an anvil for most things, so. Or a lot of things might be a better way to put it. Thundering up there? Not yet. Okay. But I heard some. How many platforms do I have? Not enough, but good enough for now.
But no, I, I'm kind of glad to be returning to Terraria, honestly. It's not like the best game in the world, but it's just a kind of nice game to just play and relax Chill too. Out. Yeah. It's a fun game. I've played it on and off since it first came out all those years ago, honestly. Which it feels like it's been a long time. It might have been like... It's been at least 10 years. I don't know if it's older than that. It is. A decent chunk of lead. Nice. So this world might not have any iron, by the way, but they made it so that uh, instead of just iron, there's like lead and stuff, so... Okay, so lead would be as good as iron for the things that I would normally be used for. I think so. Not positive on that, unlike the conversion rate, because there's... Let's see, there's lead and tin. Tin might be iron? I don't know. But yeah, there there is a... Uh, equivalent is what I'm trying to say. Ooh, there's more tin up here. Nice. You know, I'm not usually the biggest fan of Mike's Hard Lemonade, like the actual lemonade flavor, but it's actually kind of hit in the spot tonight. That's good. I typically like their black cherry better. I think it's better. I can see that. Yeah. But I bought like a box of them for a wedding uh, two weeks ago. Yeah, two weeks ago. Good wedding. Turned out it was a not quite open bar, but it was a very wet open. It was a very wet bar, so didn't need it after all. So I have a question. Yo. Where on the map are you right now? If you press M and go down, you'll uh, where? Oh, I see you. If you scroll. You might need to scroll out. Oh yeah, you're way far down there. Yeah. We didn't play for too long last time, but we were able to make a little bit of progress. Yeah. See, I told Tom in a DM, I was like, I'm gonna let Max answer, but because you know it's his game, but yeah. I was just like, I feel like having having a newbie along is actually more entertaining in a way. I'd agree, honestly. <laughs> and as, not. As is, uh, you change your team to blue, so press escape and then press blue on the right side. We should be able to see each other on the map all the time. Did I? Oh, I already did. What, do, what color are you, blue? Uh, I don't know. Sorry. Do I press the map key, you said? No, no, press escape, and then uh, on the right side. Oh, okay. I see. Yeah, I've joined the blue party now. There you go. Yeah, now you can see how many feet I am away. Oh, nice. Yeah, pretty nice, pretty nice feature. Not that I would ever necessarily really want to play a Terraria Hardcore, although it's, if I was going to do one, it would probably be a Terraria, not a Minecraft. I mean, yeah, I mean, I'd be down for a Terraria Hardcore. I was trying to convince Phil of it, but he didn't quite want to do it yet, which, I mean, it had been two years, so I don't blame him. And I yeah, think... it's not... Go ahead. Sorry. It's not hard, it's just... 
if you die, you die, so. Yeah, exactly. Like, Minecraft's hardcore, I'm probably never gonna do, because I'm no. just not that. Yeah, Terraria is basically, you either get lucky and go a long time, or you die. There's not much in between, honestly. There are zombos. On your lawn? No, not quite. Well, you should tell them to be nice then and play, play nice. Or something. Bit already? I, should build, I should build a pretty castle okay. somewhere. Oh boy! But yeah, I think my wife probably would join us for Terraria if she had a computer. That'd be cool. Yeah. Now she just has to let me build her a computer. build a castle in the sky like that Mia Ziaki movie. I just, I got a zombie. Oh, coming down with you? Yep. Yeah, that is the one bad thing about this, uh... Well, it's, it's just like, there's literally no place that it would... Oh, maybe there is a place it would have generated that was legitimate. Yeah, well, just, there, there really shouldn't be since we have all this light. Yeah, but I don't think I have... There's one part that isn't lit up. Oh, gotcha. And I think the requirements for not being generated are beyond just not having light. You might be right. I'm just so used to it from Minecraft, I guess, that I always think, oh, just light is needed. Yeah. No, you actually need light and you need, like, constructed wall ah. behind. That makes some sense, I guess. I don't like it, but I get it. That's shooting stars. Oh, that's three. Maybe it wasn't me, but somebody did. Somebody did what? Somebody uh, made a hole through the mountain, which I couldn't remember if that was me or somebody else.
It might have been somebody else, which that would have been fine. Not a problem. Are we heading towards daytime again? Is that why the music changed? Uh, it, it depends kind of how far you are underground. How far underground are you? Oh, I was I was getting close. I was getting further down. You might be just uh, far enough underground to where it changed then. Flying fish. Okay, come over here. You. You're gonna attack me. I'll kill you. The doggy dog world out here. get a better axe at some point. The current one is pretty annoying. Sorry, you are probably going to hear some uh, yawning, recovery noises from me. That's fine. I don't mind. It does look like the crimson has not been advancing at the very least, which that's good. Does the crimson generate those eyeballs, or do we do we just get those at nighttime in general? Just get those at nighttime in general. If I recall correctly, I like the crimson boss better than I like the um, the boss two that you get in corruption. Uh, I don't really remember the difference at the moment, to be quite honest. Uh, one is that, so they're, they both start with the giant eyeball, right? Yeah. Um, but then there's, um, but then there's the crimson one, which is the giant brain, and then the other one is the giant snake. Okay. And I think I prefer fighting the giant brain. I can see that, yeah. Hello! Hey, Phil, how are you? I'm fine. I don't know how long I can play, but it's, um, actually a good thing that we're early today. Oh, good. Uh, Excellent. Yeah, I was going to say, I wasn't trying to start early. I just, with 
stuff, how it panned out tonight, it made more sense just to jump to Terraria instead of starting with something else. I'm glad it worked out, so far at least. Yes. Got something going on tomorrow then, Phil? Tomorrow, no. Maybe, maybe tonight. Ah, oh, gotcha. Mother's Day stuff? Yeah. My wife's been sick all day, so she didn't really get to do anything. That's unfortunate. Yeah. More like she got a sunburn, so she's just been in bed all day. Oh, did you guys go to the beach yesterday or something? No, she did a lot of yard uh, work and forgot to put it on. Be right back. Alright. Uh, sunscreen. What? So it was mostly on her. Oh. I'm gonna do a stupid, probably. Oh, I'm doing something stupid as well, so. I'm thinking near this water, I'm gonna build a huge castle. Fair. Or at least some kind of outlook tower. Right. Some tungsten ore from that slime. Okay. It happens on occasion. I'll take it. Yeah, I'm okay with it. I just. Yeah. Hey. It's just. It's fairly rare. Okay, okay, okay. I'm back. Welcome back. What's the question of the week, Phil? What is. Oh. First of all, I'd like to know what we are actually doing right now I where think, are you guys i think we're still determined uh i can tell you that phil but if you press escape and then the blue shield on the right you can find us oh blue shield there you go okay isn't that great i suppose <sighs> uh but Kick i remember that trick I was like, Kicker Us is kind of getting his bearings at the moment. Yeah, I'm just doing random stuff. This? Oh, yeah. But it's been a while. It's been a while. I made, I made, I got, <clears throat> I made some goggles. Woo. I saw that uh, earlier when we were testing the server to make sure it would work. Now I look like a Digimon character. Digimon, digital monsters, Digimon are the Digimons. That's how the song goes. Uh, close enough. You sassing me, boy? No. Okay. Here, here you go. Have some shiruken.
Thank you. Yeah. Oh. So I uh, picked up the Trogdor board game, by the way, Phil. Oh. But I, haven't, I haven't played it yet. I'm waiting for it to arrive. It's pretty good when you have like a few people around. I believe it. And, I'm looking for and it, it it fits your style of preferring co-op games as yeah. opposed to competition. Which will be nice. Competition. I did pick up the uh, expansion as well, so. It's like I got five dollars off for older and both. So it's like, why not? Might as well. Low deal, low, low, low prices. Always Walmart. Cheap prices and tree. Oh, oh pardon me. Did you know that Walmart has always low prices? Always. I don't know where I'm going with this joke. I don't even know if uh, it really can be a joke. Maybe that's maybe that's just your method. You try something out. Yeah, I mean, just to see if it's a joke or not. I mean, yeah, some people definitely do that. Okay, I guess I'll go this way. I'm going back to the desert. Yeah. To find a horse with no mane. Something about getting lost in the rain. Da da da. da, 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 da. Got soul, but I'm not a soldier. Are you with Soul Shinra? Oh, no. I think this joke is going bad. Yeah, Again. yeah. I think you might be trying a bit too hard there. Any problem? Yeah, I can see that. Just gets darker and darker the further you go down here. I don't like it. Ouch. Oh, there's something. Don't die, Phil. But I must. I was just saying, it looks like you're going to. There's a sandworm. It's annoying. Ah. I hate sandworms. No! <laughs> I'll be fine. They're fast and annoying and they get everywhere. Uh, okay. I'll give you, I'll give you partial right? credit on that one. I am, yes. I thought it was I okay. Some okay, come on, potion. Phil. You left a ghost here. Now I have to fight it. Oh, did what? You? Yes. I didn't know you could do that. Yeah. Yeah, when you die, a ghost appears and just harasses everybody else. Oh, cool. <laughs> oh, cool. No, it's not. It's really not. I mean, technically, we can build a graveyard to get infinitely spawning ghosts. Ooh. I think only during the better leave me something useful when I kill it. Do not come back and steal that. No. What? It's I his, just spent like. It's his ghost. Well, well yeah, you but I have, just spent like. You can have that money if you want. I don't know. I, I do want that money. I just spent like 30 minutes fighting your ghost. It was I, I don't know if it was 30 minutes. It might have been 30 just seconds. Bit, actually, go ahead and take the money. That's easier than me trying to disassemble the wood. Oh. Yeah. That's easier. Don't worry about it. Okay. I was I Man. was being I was I was being a fussy baby about it. It's okay. Well, Ooh. that was obvious, but. <laughs> I see the. I, I figured see... you could use some help. You don't know it. Huh? Just... I no, I appreciate that. Now, now I know what you. Okay. Yeah. And it was like perfect timing. Nice. Oh, glitched out slime. What's she doing in there? It's being a glitched out slime. Okay. What do you think it's doing in there? Attempt number two! We should make a freaking ghost fighting arena. I mean, technically, if we make a graveyard, that's exactly what that is. Do they if just, I like, made some do... armor, that would help. Probably. <laughs> nah. So 
So how about Square Enix selling off a lot of its properties in order to invest in NFTs? I am not a fan. goodbye to Square Enix. I mean, yeah, I mean, I'm not a fan either, K Girls, but I'm a fan of them giving Deus Ex to somebody that'll use the property. Oh, that that's a good thing. Honestly, I really am, I really wonder sometimes if Enix regrets deciding to partner themselves with Square. Like, you know? Who? I don't know. I'm just over here building the fort. So, Phil, I don't know if you knew this, but Square and Enix were originally two separate companies. Enix, right. Enix the Dragon Quest, and I was saying, I wonder if Enix really regrets deciding to merge with Square. Phil! Oh no, Phil died again. How did that do 80 damage? That, however, is a good question. Okay, I'll fight the ghost. It's okay, I got it, I got it down here. It's fine. I, well, maybe. <laughs> here I come to save the day! And it's it's okay. Gold. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I got it, I got it, I got it. I, I gotta go back that way anyway. I mean, this is actually working out okay for me because then you just keep dying and generating ghosts that I fight. And they're not really that hard because we're not playing on like a hard mode. So... See? See? Silver lining right there. I, I thought the silver lining was the 50th zombie. That actually... Hold on to that banner you just got, Phil. That'll be useful. Right. No chance I'll just go and die again. But I keep my inventory. You so do. This isn't softcore, so... I hate how those words have another meaning. <laughs> yeah, it is kind of annoying. I used to think hardcore fantasy meant, like, Tolkien. Uh, that'd be nice. I mean, okay. it does, All but right. there's other. Uh, nobody... Okay, Phil, don't die. I need to answer a door knock. No promises! I'm back. Welcome back. I'm Sora. Who, uh, who's knocking on your door this late at time of night? Probably his parents. Uh, also, it's six o'clock his time, so. Yeah, it's like seven over, over here. Pardon me. Yeah, I was gonna say, not three hours behind, two hours behind. He's not in Central Standard Time, Phil. Oh, that's strange. <laughs> Okay, I'm building the base for this castle. This little fort here. Is it in the sky? No. Ah. Uh, then it'll never oh, be geez. the oh, crap. castle in the I sky. I mean, you couldn't have tell you can't tell me you didn't see that coming. Oh, him dying? Why no. don't Okay, I don't know how much damage these things do. It like hit me three times rapidly. I mean, I'll give him that one actually, yeah. I need some armor though. That's what I'm trying to find. If you come over here and you mine for some tin. Uh, you might... Tintin? I... Okay, I'll do that. Apparently I'm not good enough for the desert life. I mean, it's kind of the grindy nature of the game. Like, you have to grind right, a little yeah. bit to be able to go to the awesome places. It probably doesn't help that it's a red moon of death outside. Oh, is it? That might be making it slightly more complicated, yes. I better go upstairs to protect our uh, town's people then. Oh, can people get it? Can they get in through the do get into the doors during the red moons? Yeah. Well, that is supremely annoying. Yeah. I mean, I think if we get lead doors, they can't, but we don't have lead doors at the moment, so. This How much lead do we need for lead doors? Yes. Uh, I can't tell you off the top of my head. 
Yeah, you've got two lead bars, let me know. That's probably not enough. Probably not, I'd assume not, but... Okay. Platform, wood. Might as well I'm stay surprised. at the house for now. I'm surprised I didn't see that it announced that it was a blood moon. Well, maybe it's just a pink moon. I think it's just a pink moon, Phil. <laughs> is that a real thing? I don't know. I mean, this is a fantasy. This is just a fantasy. But basically, yeah, pink moons are fine here. Ooh, Everything, everyone seems fine. <clears throat> yeah, you just made me think something was happening, which is fine. Quick zombie oh, arm. Is this ore? Just got a zombie armor as a weapon. That's that's oh. neat. It's not too bad of a weapon, actually. Like it's not amazing, but it's it's acceptable. By the way, I talked to Sam. Yeah. He's like already in bed by now. I was just he, saying, like, he, has he keeps being in work bed by in now. The, work in the morning and East Coast. So. Sam, you gotta keep living your life exactly as you are, because I understand. That's fair. Glad he's doing well, at least. I, I assume he's doing well. Uh, yeah, they had some, they had surprising good news lately, which is good. rather personal. I don't know yep, if nope. I should get into it. Nope, fully understand. I can just over the over the natural walls with this. Okay, that's fantastic. We really want to spawn proof this area. With the uh, torches? Torches, but you also need you also need unnatural walls to spawn proof it. Oh okay. very annoying. Like right now I'm building the ground floor, which will also be the exit on the lakeside side. Is this a different house from the place that everyone is at? Oh yeah, it is. It's going to be really annoying for all of you that I'm doing this, but I wanted to build a <laughs> fort, so I'm doing it. Well, we can teleport, build teleports eventually. Oh yeah. Just take some time, that's all. Well, and I, I think I think you'll like this one. It'll be like a nice little stop that we can make along the way. Like it's not going to be like a huge advance. Like I'm just like building a little small fort. I'm world building, if you will. Yeah. Um, like you guys don't know this, but in the Minecraft game server that I've played the most on, I actually started a tradition of building hostels everywhere. So there's like little places where you can go and you can like take an item, leave an item, and there's usually like one or two beds and a campfire and possibly a crafting station. Right. Just already set up for whoever wants to come by. Not bad. Yeah, that's what I think. I think, yeah, it's, yeah, I think it's pretty cool. No, I think it's pretty cool. I do think it's pretty cool. I don't know why I did that voice. But I did. Lead doors take four. More lead bars? 
Yeah. Not awful. I'll let you all know if I find anything. Still can't make armor, though. Well, I could make some out of wood. Hey, wood armor better than no armor. So wait, did someone actually build a great? Did someone actually get the gravestone and put the ghost to rest? Because I, I noticed Phil died, but then the ghost didn't come for me. Was Max just closer? I haven't seen a ghost. Uh, how, which time? Um, the very la the last time you died. Okay, I do have a gravestone in my inventory. If, if Phil puts that gravestone down, that puts the ghost to rest, right? Uh huh. Okay. I don't know anything about this. Hello, I'm oh, Mr. Frog. I play the Terraria, but I don't know anything about it. <laughs> Are you mocking me, friend? No. Just having fun. I mean, as is, I don't know much about Terraria. Oh, the zoologist. Is that good? I don't know. Another person. Can't be that bad. Mackenzie does seem like it would be a name of a zoologist, though. Yeah. Real. Okay. And your fancy PhDs. Let's see, let's see. What if I just recreated the entire first level of Castlevania for the NES? I, I would, I would play that. Do you mean in Terraria? Yeah. Yes. Oh. I mean, it's a, it's a good distinction, but yes, he did. Yep. The only problem is we don't have a way to make the game go. Da -da -da -da. I mean, is there music blocks in this? There might be. Okay, the zoologist just sells decorative things. Does he Wait. even sell zoos? Ooh, ooh, a grappling hook. They sell grappling hooks? Yeah. That? How that much? Three is gold? Awesome. Uh, one gold and 88 silver. I have that. I'll get one. How do you use that? Right click, maybe? You gotta... I don't know. Well, you have to equip it. That's true, too. And then how do you use it? <laughs> Left click, I think? It's been a while. No. It's been a while. E. Ah. EA Sports. It's in the game. <laughs> you having fun? Make sure you don't go too high. You'll still die from fall damage. No, no, no. I, I, I'm great. I, I won't die or anything. <laughs> I feel like that's been false already. Where is someone? I need to show him my greatest great grappling hook. I think Kagros is closest to you. Yeah, yeah. Because you abandoned your d wet, damp, dark hole, Phil, and I've decided to come fill it in. <laughs> well, to... there seems to be like uh, bug eggs or something going on. In this hole? Yeah. yeah Here, looking... watch this. I'm looking, <laughs> Phil. Oh, nice. It's a squirrel on a rope. Really? Oh, that is funny. Hey, Homs. This isn't a, this isn't a square game. It's not a Mega Man game either. Which technically it should be a Mega Man game. So I'll go ahead and try to do a Mega Man sprite and that'll call it good. Cause you have to remember Homs, this is a, uh, this is Mega Man at the moment. So technically it's supposed to be a Mega Man game. There was gonna oh. be a Mega Man game. Who said oh? Well, you could like try to dress your character as the blue bomber himself. I was just gonna do some sprite art. 
Maybe like bad box okay. art Mega Man. <laughs> Everyone's favorite. Right? Ah! Oh, 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 oh. We're good. We are not good. Is what? We're good. What's happening over there? These traps are pr pr pretentious. Are the, are the, These traps are pretentious. Phil, out of curiosity, are those traps trapping you? How do you disarm a trap without it falling on you? I also hate that the EA Sports slogan is nostalgic to me. Uh, I have... So, last night, Homs, I literally just finished Mega Man Battle Network 2. But I want to do the post-game content for it. So I'm going to keep doing that because there's a little bit of stuff I want to do. And then once we're done with the post-game, we're going to go into Battle Network 3. And I'm going to do Mega Man, Bell Mega Man X6 tomorrow. You sound so excited about this. It's the worst X game in the series. People will tell you it's X7. They're wrong. Now, don't get me wrong. X7 is a bad game. But I'm willing to give X7 credit where X6 does not get credit. Because X7, they tried to do 3D instead of doing the usual 2D stuff. So they tried, oh. they failed, but they tried. I'm willing to give a developer credit when they try. However, X6 was basically very similar to X4 and 5. I wouldn't say the exact same game, but you know, very similar. And it just does not, it, it does not good. Man. Yeah, X, X6 is literally the worst game in the X franchise. I thought about just skipping it, because technically it's not even, like, basically after X5, X6, 7, 8 are not integral to the plot. Really? Yeah. So, f for X5, that was supposed to be the last game in the series. Uh, for the X series, I should say. Uh, one second. And then... So the rest of them aren't really relevant to understanding, like, Z and ZX? No. Like, no. Not, not particularly. Because it's like... X6, they basically made it, so it's like, okay... They'll go ahead and keep fighting, but it's like, no. They're not really relevant for Zero or ZX or ZX Advent. Or even Legends, since technically Legends takes place in the same, um, world. Don't they all except for EXE take place in the same world? Uh, yes, and Star Force. Star Force also takes place in the same world as EXE. Really? Uh-huh. Did not know. Yeah. Not many people know about, uh, Star Force just because I don't think it's sold very well. And Star Force isn't amazing, but it, it does have good qualities to it, where I really like. Now, if Capcom would like to go ahead and just make it so that we could, uh, you know, have a collection of X games, or not X games, we, we have that, thank you, Capcom. Um, Battle Network and Star Force games, I'd be happy with that. The, the Battle Network fans would be happy, but they have really bad opinions, so sometimes I don't want them happy, admittedly. <laughs> then again, what fandom doesn't have bad opinions? Hey, Max, fandom. Yeah. Jesus' is fandom. I, I, um, th those people have bad opinions all the time. <laughs> I mean, there are a few, yeah. Yeah. That's how we got Martin Luther. Also, on another note, we're going to get a little political. I, for one, am hoping that Roe v. Wade does get overturned. We'll see. Obviously, I'm not expecting any of you to disagree with that. Right, that's a safe political statement on this to your channel, I right. think. Right, I would agree with that. Like, you know, baby's not getting killed anymore? Sounds like a win to me. Now, I will say, we will need to go ahead and obviously get more help afterwards. So that way people can, you know, care for the babies, but... We never said that we needed to stop after Roe v. Wade gets overturned. We just needed to get the baby stop being killed. It's like, it's not I'm like glad, a I'm lot of people hear... say. 
That's okay. Um, a lot of people say that pro-life people do absolutely nothing after the baby's born, but there's so many Catholic women's centers and uh, aid that's facilities true. and charities and stuff that that's just not true. I mean, that's true, but we still need more of it. I'm not saying those don't exist, Phil, but we still need more. Sure. I, I mean, I'd be more angry, Hums, at the moment over the fact that, uh... Tecmo... Nam... Konam... Not, who does... Tekken? Who does Tekken? Bandai? Uh... Capcom? No, no. they do Street Namco. Fighter. Namco. I think it's Namco Bandai. But basically, we were supposed to get Tekken times Street Fighter, like, what, 10 years ago? Where's, get where out is of, it? Get out of here! Dead. It gets me in a corner, and there's nothing you can do. Somebody tell me if you see a ghost. I got a ghost. Alright. It's okay, though. Ooh. I know how to deal with them now. You, you kill them until they're dead? Correct. Onto the justice. Ooh. I mean, it wouldn't surprise me that somebody leaked it just so as to try to get false outrage over something that should have never happened in the first place. It wouldn't surprise me. They probably have a whole uh, laundry list of things that they can leak whenever they're trying to distract us from stuff. Yeah. I will say... Joe Biden's only been in office for two years, and he's already getting Roe v. Wade overturned. Good job on Joe Biden. I'm sure... That, that's, a, that's a joke. It was his doing, yes. It'd be nice if it was. Are you, like, we think some kind of magic wand or something? Well, yeah. Oh, him. I mean, that would be nice. Conversion arc for Joe Biden. Or repent, you, as you arc. can see, it's very effective at keeping me alive. Well, we I mean, here it is. Joel Biden. Yeah, I was gonna say, it's been 10 years since they promised Tekken versus, uh... Street Fighter. I think. Who, the White House? Yeah, they, 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 the White House said they would do Tekken versus Street Fighter. Darn you, Obama, for not giving us Tekken <laughs> versus Street Fighter. Why, I voted for that guy. Did you? No. <laughs> My fellow Americans, I will give you Tekken versus Street Fighter if you vote for me. Doesn't that is it. not... Is that a is that supposed to be an Obama impersonation? Because if so, it's it's kind of terrible. Good. <laughs> but yes, I, I I can do some good impersonations. I don't say my Obama is particularly good. Like I think my Mario isn't too bad if we're going for Captain Lou and Luigi. I'm going out for another pack of cigs, Luigi. Then we're gonna go rescue the princess. Wow. That boy ain't rot. Right, I tell you what. Whoa, go. Cool. Holy crap! I gotta go back to base and get my little hook shot next uh, next next time around. I just I just slew a pinky slime and that was that worked out very well. Found something he likes. Pop a like. Oh yeah. Yeah, I need to head back to base too. I have a bunch of uh, ore. I need to smelt.
Can I tell you how glad I am that I'm not sick anymore and I can exercise again? I imagine the answer is very. Very. Did you figure out what, what it was? No clue. Wasn't influenza, wasn't COVID, so. Maybe it was just the common cold. I, I know the common cold usually doesn't knock people in their butts, but every once in a while there's a really strong strain of it. One of my favorite tweets to go out in the last several years was like, um, something like, it sucks to get the common cold right now, because it's like everybody else got the name brand got the name brand disease, but you got Kroger Winter Illness. <laughs> <laughs> Not false. I'm gonna go out on a limb and say that Homs's question probably would be keyboard and mouse. Uh, I, I don't- it, I, it, I can't it, imagine trying to play this with a controller. It, it does work. It works pretty well, actually. Oh, that's good. I, I have it on PS4 because... Apparently, I like buying games more times than I really should, and it, it does work pretty well. I, I I would definitely say keyboard and mouse is still preferable, but you can do um if you really want to do uh, controller, you can. I, I finished him off. Well, that's something at least. That's not what the game says. I mean, it did say he killed. He got killed by him, but that is true. That's not mutually like... exclusive. We fell on each other's blade. Yeah, they might have eviscerated each other. I guess that's true. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. So I I will say I was glad to hear you talk about how. The, the sort of the, the the culture building thing is not at all over, um, no, I and just, I think yeah. that's correct because, in all honesty, I think there is a culture of people who like to build and enforce questionable laws, mm, and yeah. those laws relating to uh, recent events does sure. not necessarily mean that those people do not exist. Yeah, um, and as a matter of fact. That's probably my chief worry, is that overarching, and I'm not trying to be like a libertarian about this exactly. Sure. I'm just like literally laws that like shouldn't exist, that like take a definition of a thing that they're going to be a crime that is, that, that, that they want to be a crime that is just over and above what it should actually be defined as. Sure. And which will push, I think, a lot of cases that really ought to be covered. There's a lot of cases that really ought to be covered by the reasonable doubt provisions that are, you know, sort of known as standards for courts mm -hmm. that are going to be basically like treated as almost, I, I have, I'm worried that there are going to be a lot of cases treated as more of a guilty until proven innocent. Right. Um, not all, but It'll I feel like as, It'll definitely be Especially some... when a word has multiple ambiguous definitions, and some of those are just things that can happen to somebody. Uh, period. Yeah, that can just happen to somebody without any, without any like anything intentional happen right. being, being done. Um, sorry. Then I feel like it's especially important to write your laws to make a a a, a false accusation as impossible as possible. Sure. Like, I, I, I'm not saying that it's not a serious matter, but I would rather, I think, have cases not be prosecuted. Like, just with anything, as with anything else, basically, I'd rather have a case not be prosecuted that could be than have a case be prosecuted that shouldn't be. Makes sense. Sorry, I'm, I, I'm sorry for getting so heavy about it. I just, like, this has been on my mind. I've been worried a little bit about uh, it. Right, I can understand. And, you're all good. Not a problem. Yeah. No, I, I get it. I get it. 
Hi, by the way, Star. Sorry, didn't want to interrupt Kick Ross while he was talking. Yeah, sorry, I was on a spiel. My feelings have been mixed, not because I agree with the thing that is not being treated as a, that might not be treated as a right in the same way, but because I'm worried about the management of, of oh. aftermath in a way that actually is, you know, also pro-life and legally responsible. Sure. I can understand that. We have a bunch of owls on our house. I like it. Oh. Do I want a gold pickaxe? I'm kind of thinking about it. Sounds good. Thank you for being here, Star. Good luck with your finals. Or preparing for your finals. Man. There are people out there who still have finals. Yep. will die in, again in 10 seconds. No! I got this one! Maybe. There. I killed the enemy. But you didn't see the other enemy. Ooh, silver. Oh no! Oh no! What? I almost drowned. <laughs> Sorry. Ugh. <laughs> <sighs> Okay. There is a loud owl. I like loud owls. Okay, let's um let's uh protect this. Okay. 
I have to say, I kind of hate Mackenzie's lines, though. She brought me something useful, which I appreciate. But I hate her lines. I don't need yeah. her to tell me. I don't need her to tell me how she's a furry. Ooh, yeah. Mackenzie. Is she? In in the most annoying way. I got bit by a fox, and now I'm a fox. It's like okay. Like not a good furry, to clarify. I have no problems with the furries. fox. Radioactive. It's radioactive. Radioactive. I'll hold on to that just for. Hey, wait, where is Mackenzie? That fox. Oh, there it is. As okay. I say, that fox girl, literally right in front of you. Are are owls not that smart? That makes me sad. I like I like the image of smart owls. Oh gosh. Wait, what? Oh, I need 88, one gold and 88 silver. Oops. Oh, well. What? Okay. So, I guess that's a glitch of sorts. In, the, in my own hands. Oh, fair. Oh, you're down my tunnel. So you're going to kill him? I am. Not actually. No, no, I'm on blue team, remember? Betrayal. It's so funny. My my five year old kid knows that word and can use it properly. That is pretty funny. How much Halo do you let your kid play, Phil? Uh, none. I don't have an Xbox. But you have a computer. Among us. Among us. Among us. I was really stoked. Um. There was like that Jeopardy question. I think it was like Sean or somebody posted it. Yeah. His Discord. That um, somebody actually said the word Among Us, but they oh, said it close. like the meme. Yeah, that's true. They did. I was very delighted for that. It was, it was all about funny. that pronunciation. Oh, I thought it might have just been the ground that was hurting you. I was gonna say, I'll tell you what, Phil. It's not me doing it, so. And it wasn't. I don't know. You appeared, I suddenly started taking massive damage, so. That is true. Oh. But it wasn't me. This time. Maybe you led time. them to me. That part is possible. Still wouldn't be my fault. It's not my fault. I'm not to blame. Something about a gypsy woman in my plane. Ave Maria. Blah, 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 blah. I don't remember the song. Something about that gypsy woman, Esmeralda. 
And Lord Frollo really likes her in ways that he shouldn't. Lord Farquaad. Lord Farquaad, yeah. Ooh, a glowing red thing! What even is that? More glowing red thing! Hmm. I don't know what that is. That's a good question. I'm taking your silver ore since you didn't pay attention to it. Fine. Enjoy drowning. I didn't drown, Phil. Now I'm taking your red thing. Uh, I doubt that we can mine that right now. I actually think I can. Enjoy mining it. Right now. I do have a gold pickaxe. I'm just not using it because it's got awful stats. But it does have higher pickaxe power, so. Oh, man. You alright? I'm good. The goal here is that eventually uh, this will have a fort, but it'll be more of a pass-through. Mm -hmm. So it'll be designed so that people can run through it on the way to their desk if they want to. Fair. As is, I'm surprised we haven't seen any heart uh, containers yet. Oh! Okay, cool. What? Whoa, what's hurting me? Ah, no! No, you don't! I founded it! You fiend! <laughs> My precious! Come here, pal, I'll give it to you. You um, sent that on. bat after me. I did not send that bad after you, but it did work. Come here, okay. I'm gonna try to drop it and not use it. I know we've had problems with this before. Okay, uh, right click. Yep, I did. There you go. Go. So literally, Yay. K Cross, as I said, we haven't seen any heart containers yet. Phil literally lights up a torch, and there's one. It's like, mmm. So Angry. your immediate Yay. response was, how can I screw over Phil right now? And I stole it from him, but I give it back. Good for you. He Ravens are smart. A, a cave bat. A keys. If you keys. Keys. Crimtain Enjoy orcus? mining that red thing. I, I mean, I can. Oh, what is it? Crimtain? Somebody look up what Crimtain ore is. Ask your doctor if Crimtain is right for you. Crimtain gives me the runs, personally. So I've been seeing all these ads for, like, pharmaceuticals lately uh -huh. in, like, YouTube context. And they'll just be like, ask your doctor about... And then it is laying the name of the pharmaceutical. And I'm just like, wasn't there a time... I mean, these are YouTube ads, so they have to be, like, really short, I guess, but, like... Wasn't there a time when you actually at least said what the drug was supposed to help with? Like, you didn't just like say, ask your doctor about this drug. You'd be like, hey, if you're depressed. Probably, or, you know, but whatever. that costs more ad space. Oh, but Apparently. it's like YouTube, like. I think they're just trying with them. Maybe if we throw enough stuff at them, they'll try to look into it and they'll give us money. Apparently those type of pharmaceutical ads are illegal in Europe. Be nice they really probably here. should be. Isn't it great that we can just throw squirrels around and it is. fly? Too bad we got it from a weird lady, but... We saved them! We did save them from that weird lady, that's true. She might have put them down her pants. Um... I mean, it's possible. You don't know this. Well... It seems... Let me ask you this. Where where are we keeping them right now? I hate... I hate it, Phil. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want my squirrel no more. Hey, guys, I found some more lead. Nice. Just don't get any poisoning. I'll try. Ah, go ahead. Oh, no, I mean, if you're not going to take it. Actually, there's some more crimtain ore. I'll go get that. And this, because you didn't see this. I want this. So 
social credit deducted. Oh. Ooh, skeleton. Skelly men can sometimes have good loot. They can also hurt my butt. Oh, this one's hurting my butt. Okay, he did not kill me. Maybe this skeleton will kill me. Because as you've been able to tell from all the memes lately, apparently all millennials want to do is not exist anymore. I'm sorry, just anybody that says that they never asked to be born when somebody says your mother could have aborted you and says, I never asked to be born, it's like, shut up. You're stupid. Get out of here. Well, I think I think the wanting to die thing has actually been like a millennial gag for a while. Yeah, I mean it has, but it's no. it's never been one that I found funny, and I'm a millennial, so maybe I'm just too cool. Said the person well, playing I Terraria. Mean, there, there you go. I mean, but that's that's the real key to it. If you're cool, you don't want to die. I mean, I, I want to die, but cool. I don't want- I don't want to hate my life. Like, if I don't die, Phil, okay, I can't get to cool, heaven. Okay, if you're cool, you won't hate your life. Yeah. There you go. As I say, Problem if I, solved. If I don't die, Phil, I can't get to heaven. I mean, eventually. Yeah. Eventually. Spooky, scary skeletons send shiver down I, your spines. I hear this sandworm again. You better get some better armor then, boy. So, Phil, did you find an accessory that lets you see enemies that are nearby you? Yes. Okay, because I was going to say, whenever I'm near you, I see something in the top right corner that says enemies detected. It's like, I've never seen that before. Yeah, it tells me how many enemies are nearby, but it doesn't, like, pinpoint them or anything. No, but it's still convenient. But either way, I think of that scene from uh, Smiling Friends where, you know, you got the frowning friends. I was like, ah, oh, the world sucks. We're all going to die. And then Mr. Bossman busts down the door and it's like, you know, he's starting to kill. I was like, no, 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 I don't want to die. It's like, yep, that's about right. Oh, hold on. That's there's, it. it's, there's a very valuable lesson right there. I mean, only to people that are smart enough to get it because I saw some people say, oh, I hate that scene for Smiling Friends. <sighs> They put they the guy the character that says it afterward just dumbs it down by making everybody have to understand it. It's like yes, because you're too stupid to understand it. That's exactly the point. You're still too stupid to understand it. Congratulations, you played yourself. To be fair, that's not the fault of the writers. That's the fault of their interpreters. Yes. How many skeletons is this? Is it just two? Might just be two. Hey, real talk. How many ghosts am I fighting in the next five minutes? Uh, um, Haha, <laughs> not me. I don't want to go into the skeleton room, so I'm gonna say none. I I see a bloody skull right here. I see the little silhouette of a man scaramouche. Uh, this game does have sandworms, so it is partially Dune. Yes. Phil has died to the. Actually, I don't think you've died to the sandworms, have you, Phil? Uh, yeah? Okay, Phil's died to the Probably. sandworms. He, he, yeah. he didn't like the spice. Yeah. Or something. I'd need to actually read Dune, but I'm working on Augustine City of God at the moment, so I have... I have a little bit of a ways to go before I get anywhere. I'm liking Augustine City of God, but I feel really dumb about it. God bless you, honey. Haha! <laughs> Incoming waters! Ha ha ha! I don't think Take it's that. gonna... Oh, nope, it did go higher than I wanted. That's unfortunate. That's for that bat attack earlier. I should have kept the heart container then. <laughs> uh... Ooh, skeleton room! Let's go! I did say skeleton room! Do I have 
Oh man, my inventory is like full. What is that? Oh cool, more defense. Can I get above there? I have some grenades. I'll catch a grenade for ya. Do Pilates for you. I don't know where I'm going with this. What are you? Put a, my hand on a blade for ya. My wife knows these lyrics, apparently. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I can drown the skeleton. You can? Probably not. I was yeah, say. I was gonna say that. That wouldn't make sense. I'm just going over my options of attack. On skeleton? Yeah. shouldn't be able to get me from up here. Haha, -ha, okay. A bat! Ah! I'm not anywhere near. Can't blame me for this one. Okay, okay. Skeletons beware. You're in for a scare. Is that goosebumps? It is goosebumps. I have too much that stuff work to read at the moment. Extremely well. My library is always expanding of books I want to read. It's a blessing and a curse. We're about halfway down. Well, this Phil hasn't died for 26 minutes, so he's got that going for him. That's nice. Neither of you. <laughs> yes. I should hope not, since I'm the one bringing it up. Skeleton treasure! Anything good though? Problem. Find this stuff and then I gotta go and unload my inventory and then probably log off. Oh, you gotta go off already? That's fair. Yeah. I'd be interested in that, Palms. That's fair. You wanna see what Crimtain Ore is? One second, I'm gonna check this out. Anybody have any spare graystone like that's just rotting in a chest somewhere? Uh, gravestone? 
No, Greystone. Uh, not as far as I'm aware, no. I probably have some rotten in my inventory somewhere. Bad skeleton. A bomb. Have some water. Send some down to me. Um. Oh, I went to the left. No, okay. Right. Okay. Now I gotta get out of here. Oh, <laughs> that was pretty great. Forget what you need to craft a fallen star into like more mana. You need five fallen stars. Oh, five. Okay, I thought maybe I, I was thinking three. That that explains the problem. Okay. Sounds good, Hams. We'll talk to you later. God bless. Have a good night. That's fair, I'll look into both of those. I appreciate it. I'm starting to get a little tired early tonight, too, so I don't know. I'd be fine with going one more hour after this. What do you think, Kigros? I would be okay either way, because I have also been legitimately way too, like, I've been up way too late last night. Fair. Um, and the night before. Um, uh, yeah, I'd be fine with calling it once Phil's calling it, then. A little bit of a shorter yeah. stream, but that, that happens sometimes. It's just, sometimes you're just tired. And then I can look at other stuff that I might be doing tonight. That's fair. A little bit sooner. Or so sooner. Then we can do more Terraria. Phil, are we doing Terraria next week or Dark Souls? If I can find find the time to get a copy of Dark Souls, we'll do Dark Souls. Okay. Then we'll just alternate each week. Sure. Okay. So yeah, we're not abandoning Terraria, Kate Cross. You're more than welcome to join us. We're just Oh yeah, totally. Yeah. Just oh, I got you. That makes sense. Yeah. Just didn't want you to think we were abandoning you. Yeah. Well, it's probably for the better if I if I play. Ter it is it is definitely in a, in a sense probably for the better if I don't play a lot of Terraria, but it also it, I'm going to playing it in a sort of controlled-ish fashion, mm -hmm. where. Yeah, we'd only be playing it like every once every week at the most. Yeah. Oh man. So you found a salamander over here, Phil. I don't know what a, what a sal salamander. Found a water buffalo. Oh, okay. Yours is fast, but mine is slow. 
Damn, yeah. Wait, Punch, what's the other... Hey, Punch. What's the... What are the first two digging games you enjoy? Minecraft is my guess. And... Dig Rock Galactic. Oh, that's true. Dig Rock Galactic. Deep... Dang it, Phil. Deep Rock Galactic. <laughs> How you doing, Punch? Get away from me, you skeleton man. Oh, this is a much faster way to go up the hole. You what? Okay, honey. You have a good night's sleep, okay? Oh gosh, this is... There's my second death of the game. Max! I made a bad choice, but I'm gonna go back and kill him because I want my gold back. Digging. Digging's fun. I was gonna say, I can't think of many other game. Well, I'm sure there's many games that you dig, but I know Terraria just really nailed the digging aspect of it. I'd say Minecraft did too in a different way, as does Deep Rock Galactic. Oh, excuse me. They're just all games that are fun to dig in and all a little bit different in how they handle the digging. I found another life crystal. Guy has it. Yeah, I'll put it in the the first floor chest. Awesome. I'll be there in a second. I just gotta go get my stuff back. Oh, I do have recall potions. Just say, oh. Punch, if you'd like to join us, you are more than welcome to. Oh. I, I can get you the IP. I'm about to stop. That is true. <laughs> Phil did say he was gonna end for the night because he... Would like to go spend some time with the missus, I assume? Yeah. Yeah, which is fair. It's good to want to spend time with the missus. My missus just went to bed, so... She was tired. She got sunburned yesterday. I think I said that on stream. I can't remember. Ah! Oh, the salamander's gone. I wanted to kill it. Mm. Oh, well. Dad, what's he so crawled about? Oh gosh! What? Craw dads do a lot of damage, by the way. Good to know. They uh, they do 57 points of damage. I just found out. That's fair, punch. Yeah, I was gonna say. I've figured out how to IP port forward again. It's been a while. I haven't done port forward in years at this point, honestly, so. Force, 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 force over on. So there you go. It is. All right. Have I'm a good night, Field. Now. Take care. We'll talk to you soon. Thanks for joining us. Enjoy oh. the lack of ghosts. Hey, hey, I'll, I'll provide the ghost. Don't you worry about that, Phil. Okay, carry on the good work, then. All right. Talk to you. You have a good night, Phil. Great, bye. Good bless. Yeah, and I just, I haven't touched it in years, because it's like, most of the stuff I play these days just does it for you. Whereas Terraria, I remember, no, that one you specifically have to do. So it's like, okay, time to brush up on it a little bit, which was fine. It's just been years. Okay, I have the start of a castle. Nice, I will come check it out in a second. Yes. Salamander. 
Even if it's a different salamander. Oh, my head. I'm really not looking forward to Mega Man X6 tomorrow, okay, Ross. Well, you don't have to play Mega Man X6. No. And I'm really considering just skipping straight to Mega Man Zero, honestly. So at least that's a game I enjoy. It's hard, but I like it. Like, here's the thing. The Mega Man X or Zero games, they were meant to be hard. I don't think X6 was meant to be hard. It's just badly designed. Oh. Yeah, I made a game like that once. That was badly designed? I mean... Every, yeah. Everybody has to do that one, once. Everybody has to do that once in a while, unless you're a big studio like Capcom. Yeah, but I it's like way too late. I, I want like the achievements, Punch! But I could get the achievements in Mega Man Zero. Hmm. I think that's enough for me to take the hint and just do Mega Man Zero instead. What'd you say, K Gross? Sorry. Uh, I don't worry about it. Alright. I was just saying it was I was saying it was way too late in my game designing I guess career for me to really justify how bad it was. Sure. It was actually the sort of thing that might have been okay, but it, first of all, it, its main mechanic needed to be forgiven. So like all attacks, including like the ones that help you traverse uh, jumps, the like, right. extra jumps, those were all on a stamina meter mm -hmm. that had like a pretty gnarly cooldown. Uh -huh. And so like whenever you landed from like a double jump, even if you'd failed to make it, you had to wait for the whole, you'd wait for like half the bar to fill up again before you could use it again. Right. And really what it should have been was give it like half a second. And if the, and if the player doesn't do anything else, and they're on land, you just refill basically the whole thing. Yeah. In like in like the next one second minimum. Right. Um, but also the levels themselves like weren't. I don't know there were some other limitations. Like I had some magazine limitations. Like if you imagine a game where I did not design around the limitations as well as well as I did with the Ruin Diver, that's that's another problem the game had. Sure. But um, it also like just had a. Um, I just didn't have a good sense of like level. Like I didn't ease the player into into things con that in, into concepts that really they needed to be eased into. I can understand that. If it does happen. So I think I'm just gonna have a bridge go over this lake. Sure. Instead of right over, like it's just gonna be like actually over the lake, and that way you can still like go on the lake. And, Makes like, sense. Do 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 do. do. trying to decide if I want to go to the next level of armor since I basically am already past both tin and lead now. I might want to.
Did you just gasp at me? No. Alright, I'll leave. No, I'm just trying to do my best to make sure that things that things that are zombies can't get in here. Fair. <clears throat> like basically all the things that can get in are airborne and only they and even they can only get into like a small area. Right. Not the worst thing in the world then. Sometimes slimes are coming up from the depths. There's some mining. There's going to be some mining access, but I think it'll still be relatively safe. I still need to do that punch, so I probably should look into that. Is it really that much of a problem, I guess, or is it just they're doing it because Microsoft probably? They're doing a they're doing a micro or a Minecraft thing. For uh, clarification, get gross. Yeah. But they're basically transitioning away from Java, which is weird. Very annoying. <laughs> yes, yes. Like, no. I, I'm just like, I don't really care. That, like, I know you guys own this, but like, I want to play with my friends who are on Macintosh computers, and this is going to make it more, unless you're committed to building Mac and Linux versions, I don't want to hear that you're going away from Java. They're not. Not more committed, I mean. Yeah. Yeah, okay, yeah, good, they... good point, Punch, yeah. <sighs> that, that comment right there, Punch, tells me all I need to know. Just because it worked for them doesn't mean I like it. Man's gotta eat. Zero ten, they call them fireflies, not lightning bugs. Lightning bugs are the much cooler term for them. Oh, did I do it too far? I might have. Yeah, I did it too far. Do I really care that much? Yes. Yeah. I mean, that sounds like them entirely, yeah. I, I agree, yeah. Demon eyes can fly through the platforms now. I think they could for a long time, actually. Oh, well, that's very sad because it means I can't build a demon eye farm. Oh, that is sad then. Yeah. But I got a couple lenses. So that's nice. That is nice. That looks nice. Yeah. That looks pretty nice. That does not though.
You're fine. I don't mind punch. Yes, yeah, everybody likes Java better. It's just yeah. I, I'll give Microsoft some. Okay, I won't give them credit, but I, I will give them a little bit of surprise that it took them this long to decide to uh, transition away from Java. I thought they would have wanted to do that years ago. I don't give them credit for it, but I am surprised. It's weird because like Microsoft has sort of like I think tried to be a little more control freaky, and I don't know to what degree they've actually succeeded. Um, granted, I'm only on when I'm still on Windows 10. Yeah, and I'm I understand there was issue even with like upgrading to Windows 10 and people just like waking up and finding their computers upgraded without minded expressly that. mind minded that. Yeah. So I went back to Windows 7 until eventually I had to switch to Windows 10. Mainly just when my hard drive died, and then I didn't have access to Windows 7 anymore, because it's like, I could pay for Windows 7, but at that point it's way too expensive by the time I was looking into it again. Was like, That's I was, unfortunate. Yeah, I, was, I did not want to pay uh, $300 for a copy of Windows 7 at that point. It's like, no, I like Windows 7 better. It's the better OS. I don't disagree with that, even remotely, but it's like, I'm not paying $300 for this. Did it brick tens of thousands of computers? I didn't realize it did that. That would explain why they didn't do it with Windows 11 this time, though, where they actually asked you at the very least. Well, they, they well they also like they make you like they check your computer to see if it's able to do it first. Like they have their own set of requirements. At least they finally learned. See, I didn't realize that Windows 10 had bricked a bunch of computers. That, yeah. I am not surprised by that. Come on, scroll. Might be able to get it from the other side a little more easily. Yeah, that should that should be easier. I will admit the fact that the squirrel hooks can go ahead and uh, do trees as well is, re is really nice. Oh, they can. Yeah. That that doesn't surprise me. It's not a good thing, mind you, but it doesn't surprise me. Sounds like something they would say, unfortunately. Brown brick. In Minecraft. -er. Do you like brown bricks? Yes, 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 okay, good, good, good. Ah. Chair. Tables.
Oh, thank goodness. Eyeballs. Oh. Okay, I guess one came up from the depths somehow. Cool. Okay, so we have probably plenty of housing now for most people. Are you doing okay. housing over there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I added two more rooms. Hey, Max. Yeah. As I said, that does not sound like a good plan, as you were saying, bunch. What was that, uh, okay, Chris? I was gonna say, come over here and uh, see the castle. Or I guess I'll come over there and see the other thing first. All right. We could build a road, or we could build a minecart track. Yeah, that requires a lot of materials, though. Yeah, well. I'm not saying no, just saying not yet. Need a lot of materials, yeah. Oh, wait. Okay, okay. Why is it shaped like a wing? Like, why does it look, look kind of like an airplane? You know, it kind of does. I don't know. I just kind of went with that. I, it's just, I, I like it. Yeah, it's pretty nice. It's just, I was, it was confused. Right, but yeah. As, uh, my guess is that they always double check. Oh. I hope they always double check. I have a blue slime banner. I can put it over here. Yay. That works. Uh, let me check one quick thing. Hold on. I won't do that, but I don't want to do that yet. Okay, hold on. There, okay, guys. I'm getting some stuff out of my. Uh... Oh, we have a nurse now. That that took a long time. Yeah. Yeah, I was gonna say that sounds about right. Punch. It's like you try, but it's like something always goes wrong. Sounds about right. Wait, I need that actually. Very much so still. I can make one quick thing for you. That's okay. true. They did. So that's a good point. You just well, they didn't even check to see if people could run it, and they didn't care about the consequences. Did they ever get a lawsuit for that? What is this weird music that's happening? Like, what? It's a thing. Basically, it's very windy today. They do music so as to indicate something is going on uh, in the overworld. I don't dislike it, but it's a little weird. God love you. Oh hey, thank you for the follow there, the rat, rat who ate your toes. Hope you're doing well today. I mean... I can think of a couple ways to lose p public trust punch, but that's fair. Yeah, I was gonna say that is definitely a pretty big one. I don't remember how to make a loom. Give me a second, kick Russ. All right. So I'm trying to make beds so that way we can set the um, spawn points. Oh, set points. the spawn point. Yeah. Okay, we need a sawmill. How do we make a sawmill? Chains. Okay, I defeated the hundred slimes, so I'm gonna I'm gonna put that one over here. Okay. Do you have chains? That I can make. I 
I don't know if I can make one at the moment. Hmm. Back over here. That is a lot of stuff at the moment. Okay. I don't know if I do have any chains at the moment. That's unfortunate. Or if I can make any chains, I guess would be the better way to put it. What do you need to make chains? See, like 10 or something? Yeah, something like that. I got like one tin bar. Oh wait, there's chains. I'm just blind. Whatever. May not be able to make a sawmill now. That's true, yeah. Salt in the wound. Yeah, that's a good point. Do you have any iron bars out of curiosity there? Um, I've got three lead bars if you need them for anything. Yeah, actually. Like if you want to stop main from being attackable during the blood thingy things. Oh, but I've also got... A, uh, mm, I've got I a just, plant splitting, spitting I, stuff at me. I'm coming. So I better, I better not try to try to get over there right now. I'm coming. I probably have more armor than you. You might, yeah. I've just got some tin armor, basically, and like wood greaves. Oh, this is looking nice. I like it. Thank you. Yeah, I was gonna say if you yeah, got. So I'm thinking I'm gonna like you got a little nice running area, so like yeah, like Phil can just like run through basically, but right. then eventually there's gonna be like a bridge going up about where I'm standing right now. Yeah. Um, and where the blue the level the blue banner's on, I'm just gonna pick put that bridge just like a giant bridge over the over the water. Makes sense. Yeah, and probably do like some kind of stupid tower. I don't know exactly how I'm gonna do this, but hey, I feel happening. like a high like. I can do both, like maybe just have the bridge be like a gap, have like a gap in it that you have to jump over, and then uh, and then have a high jump for okay. anybody who feels like uh, like doing a high jump into the water. Right. Yeah, I'll probably work on building my own house here eventually, just not quite yet. Yeah, I just need like one lead bar if you got it. Oh, you do? Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna grab it. Let me just, I'm just gonna drop them. All right. You if, you, if you don't mind, if I take all of them. Nope, I don't. All right. Oh boy, I know we said we were gonna stop when Phil stopped, so. Yeah, let me. Build, I might. I might. Let me build this bed, and I'll say we can stop there. Okay, I'll come set my spawn where you're at, assuming I can get there. Oh, I was just gonna come give you a bed. Oh, that'd be nice. Yeah, I wouldn't mind. Uh. See if I can find the sawmill. Oh. Pardon me. What if you asked that and I was just like, no? I would have just been like, okay, I guess we don't get nothing then. But can be crashed at the workbench. Why? Any wood? I have ten wood, right? Do I have ten wood? Yes, I do. Okay. You know, if I could search for something specific, that'd be nice. There it is, okay. So we need a loom. Silk, I'm pretty sure. Let's double check. Hold on.
so. Just, yeah, that should be good, okay. Hopefully that's enough for at least one bed. I know I wouldn't be, but you never know. A sofa, a bench. Is it good to kill a gnome? Kill a gnome? Yeah. Uh, I have no clue, honestly. That's a good question. One that I don't really have an answer to, admittedly. Get the gnome? You've been trying to get the gnome for years, Punch? Am I missing a joke? Possible. Wouldn't put it past me. Hey Max, can you put the can you put the bed in the room that I'm in right now? Yeah. Yay! Oh, that is fair. Uh, hold on, let me see what the gnome does. I want to see if we should kill him. Oh boy. Well, he's down here. Yeah, I saw him. You might be trapped down there a little bit. Oh, uh, you don't need to kill him, but if you can bring him to the surface during the day, it'll turn him to stone. Okay, what? Why? Okay, well, I, I'm not gonna. I'm gonna kill him then. If that's way easier. All right. Sorry, I. You do get an achievement for turning him to stone. I. No, I. I forgot about Travelocity Punch. It's like, man, I. Whatever happened to Travelocity Gnome? Did he die? Did he die? I don't know. Like, man. Uh, Travelocity and the, the Priceline Negotiator, the two I remember when they... The Priceline Negotiator was uh, William Shatner, wasn't he? That sounds right, yeah. I'm double checking now. And now we've got that really annoying emu, and it's like, please stop. It's really annoying. Yeah, it is William Shatner. I don't know if the Priceline Negotiator died, or... I don't think William Shatner died. Not yet, at the very least. Hopefully he stays alive for a while. And hopefully he dies in a state of grace. If he's Catholic, if he's not Catholic, he uh, converts before he passes away. Okay. How old Shatner is? Shatner is pretty old, like 80? 80? 88? He is Jewish, but things can happen before he passes away. I still want the best for the man. But yes, he is Jewish as of the moment, as far as my knowledge is aware. Oh, did you log off, Kcross? Yeah, I just logged off. Okay, I'm gonna go back to my house then and log off as well. I'd say this was a good amount of stuff, though. Yeah, we got a lot of stuff done in about two and a half hours. Yeah. Hey, miracles happen, Punch, but I hear you. As I know you know, I just, I don't know why I'm... Ugh, yeah, I'm just tired now. We'll end with Night Prayer, though. Do you want to join me for Night Prayer, Cake Rose? Sure. Right, um, me... Is there anything you want me to tackle on the Night Prayer front? Uh, I mean, if you want to. I have. I have hymns in this book, but they don't match the ones on the thingy thing. I am waiting for my book to come in. I picked up the uh, daily prayer book from uh, Bishop Barron. Just hasn't gotten here yet. Yeah. 
Let me do one last thing as well so I don't forget it for next time. Oh, 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 too far. There we go. Not that this really matters, but it looks nice. That'll work. Not gonna be in big enough for a room, I'm almost positive, but too small, but it looks nice. Okay, let me let me log off. Uh, let me see. Settings, save and exit. Exit. And you guys are just gonna have to remind me to do this next time. All right, let me see. Help. Exit. Okay. All right, let's go ahead and end with night prayer then. I took off my headphones, which means I can't hear Cake Ross if I do that. I better put those back on. Those make it a little harder. Yeah, a little bit of a shorter stream tonight. That's fine, though. And then we'll be back tomorrow. Oh, I'm just going to go to Mega Man Zero. I'd rather go to a good game. A hard game, but a good game. Okay. Hey, Father, Son, Holy Spirit, Amen. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, as now, will be forever. Amen. Alleluia. I confess to Almighty God and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned in my thoughts and my words, and I've done and I failed to do. Through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore, I ask Blessed Mary, ever Virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. At the Lamb's High Feast we sing, praise to our victorious King, who has washed us in the tide, flowing from his wounded side. Praise the Lord, whose love divine gives his sacred blood for wine. Christ gives the body, pardon me, gives his body for the feast, Christ the victim, Christ the priest. Where the paschal blood is poured, death's dark angel sheaths his sword. Israel's host in triumph go, through the waves that drown the foe, Christ the Lamb whose blood was shed, paschal victim, paschal bread. Let us with a fervent love taste the manna from above. Mighty victim from on high, powers of hell now vanquished lie. Sin is conquered in the fight. You have brought us life and light. You have risen from the grave. Christ is open paradise, and, him, and in him all men shall rise. Easter triumph, Easter joy, sin alone can this destroy. Souls from sin and death set free. Glory in their liberty. Hymns of glory, hymns of praise. Father, unto you we raise. Risen Lord, for joy we sing. Let our hymns through heaven ring. Amen. Aliyah, Aliyah, Aliyah. Poor, poor man's prayer and trouble. Blessed be God who comforts us in all our trials. Turn your ear, O Lord, and give answer, for I am poor and needy. Preserve my life, for I am faithful. Save the servant who trusts in you. You are my God. Have mercy on me, Lord, for I cry to you all day long. Give joy to your servant, O Lord. For to you I lift up my soul. O Lord, you are good and forgiven, full of love to all who call. Give heed, O Lord, to my prayer. And attend to the sound of my voice. In the day of distress I will call, and surely will reply, Among the gods there is none like you, O Lord, nor work to compare with yours. All the nations shall come to adore you, and glorify your name, O Lord. For you are great and do marvelous deeds, you who alone are God. Show me, Lord, your way, so they may walk in your truth. Guide my heart to your name guide my heart to fear your name. I will praise you, Lord my God, with all my heart, and glorify your name forever. For your love to me has been great. You have saved me from the depths of the grave. The proud men have risen against me. Ruthless men seek my life, to you they pay no heed, but you, God of mercy and compassion, slow to anger, O Lord, abounding in love and truth, turn and take pity on me. O give your strength to your servant, and save your handmaid's son. Show me the sign of your favor, that my foes may see to their shame, that you counsel me and give me your help. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, as now, will be forever. Amen. Aleluya, aleluya, aleluya. Max, we're on Monday. We're at, uh, it's Sunday. Uh, it's, uh, you're right. Well... Okay, let's go back. We'll reset it. You could, I mean, you could just start off with the reading if you. Yeah, if you want that's it. not bad. I don't think that would be. Yeah, for some reason, I bear very like changes over very early in the day. I don't know why they do that. I appreciate the talent. I mean, tell, I, yeah, I appreciate that. That's what I'm trying to say. Yeah. Okay. They shall see the Lord face to face and bear His name on their foreheads. The night shall be no more. They will need no light from lamps for the sun. For Lord God shall give them light, and they shall reign forever. Into your hands, Lord, I commend my spirit. Alleluia, alleluia. Into your hands, Lord, I commend my spirit. 
Alleluia, alleluia. Alleluia. You have redeemed us, our God of truth. Alleluia, alleluia. Alleluia, alleluia. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Into your hands, Lord, I commend my Lord, spirit. My spirit. Alleluia. 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 Pardon me. Protect us, Lord. Stay awake. Watch over us till we sleep. Awake me, keep watch for Christ, and sleep rest in his peace. Alleluia. Christ the light of the nations and the glory of Israel. Lord, now you let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. My own eyes have seen the salvation which prepared inside of every people. A light revealed to the nations and the glory of people of Israel. Glory to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, as now, will be forever. Amen. Protect us, Lord, stay awake. Watch over us so we sleep. That wake me, keep watch of Christ, and sleep rest in his peace. Alleluia. Let us pray. Lord, we have celebrated today the mystery of the rising of Christ's new life. May we now rest in your peace, safe from all that could harm us, and rise refreshed and joyful. To praise you throughout another day, we ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. May the all-powerful Lord grant us a restful night and a peaceful death. Amen. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious Advocate, thine eyes of mercy toward us, and after this, our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O most holy Mother of God, that we might be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Amen. May the Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Amen. All right. Thank you for joining me, Kate Russ. Yeah, no problem. All right. Well, with, um, go ahead. Sorry. I'm sorry. No. Oh, fine. nothing. All right. I was going to say, well, with that, we'll go ahead and sign off. I'll be back tomorrow. I actually am going to do Mega Man Bell Network 2 tomorrow. I realized I have something on Tuesday, so I'd rather do the shorter stream for Mega Man Zero just because that's not an RPG. RPGs take more time. So, all right. With that, we'll see you guys all tomorrow. You all have a good day. God bless. Remember that God loves each and every one of you. Go and see tomorrow. Good night, everybody. God bless.